Hello, everybody. Today I'm here with Koopa Troopa doing the next set of levels. Now, I wasn't able to do all of them with Koopa Troopa. Um, I definitely wouldn't recommend using him. But yeah, one of them I couldn't do. And I think I'll actually be surprised by which one uh, I couldn't do with them. Um, particularly because the skill should be useful and it's just not. But yeah, this first one we, here we had a all right time with. Uh, it took a couple of tries, I think just two. But uh, yeah, like I said, Koopa Troopa doesn't come in handy here because he only breaks blocks. And he can just get rid of some viruses in the meantime. Um, but for this level, uh, you're getting rid of all of the blue coins and all of the the viruses. And the blue coins are mostly under the electric boxes, if not exclusively under the electric boxes. So basically you have to get rid of all of them. Uh, they might as well have just made you get rid of those because it's the same thing. And once you get rid of all of the uh, viruses, then you just have to work on it on your own. But while the viruses are there, like you can see there's a space in between the blues there. And the same thing with the greens. I would suggest uh, putting a blue and a green underneath those so that you can hit some electric boxes while you're getting rid of them. Uh, that was the strategy that I used that helped me to get to the three stars that I needed. I also placed that green one there just because I want to use it later, but I don't want to put it in a place where it's not going to be available. I'm going to be able to gain access to that once I clear out this blue one here. Then I can use it to my advantage right there. And I think that's a pretty good way to do it. Uh, if you have something that you don't need uh, yet, but you know you will soon, it's a good thing to uh, like put it on some viruses or something. And anywhere that you can put it that you can still access um, underneath that and clear it out at a different time and use it uh, when you need to. But yeah, now that we've gotten rid of all the viruses, which I guess did have some blue coins as well. Uh, but you do need to clear the viruses on their own anyway, so you might as well get rid of those first. And then you just have these few electric boxes left in the corner, making sure to line everything up at the right time. Uh, I think I go for this top one first, just because everything else is um, lined up in a way so that uh, they can all be cleared at the same time. Maybe I don't do that, I don't remember what I did. But the, the two outs, outside ones might be offset uh, with the other ones. But you should have enough capsules no matter what doctor you use. Because as you can see, I used um, Dr. Koopa Troopa, who is busy getting rid of some crates that, is, uh, that I never need to clear. While I'm actually doing all the work over here. So you can really bring in any doctor. Uh, Roy would probably help to get rid of the crates, but I don't know if how helpful he actually would be. Wario is good. We really need someone that helps get rid of electric boxes because those really become a problem. Um, but it, maybe that would be a little too overpowered on levels like this. But either way, we cleared that one and I didn't think I had enough um, capsules left to clear this one, but you don't need a lot of points. I'm guessing 20,000 is the cutoff and I just, uh, I guess not barely made it. I made it pretty, pretty well. Uh, but yeah, that level wasn't too bad. Moving on to the next one. Again, I was able to use Koopa Troopa, so you can really use any character you want. But I'll go through some of the suggested ones that I can think of. Uh, I believe it has, yeah, it has the colored boxes. So Larry would probably be pretty good. Um, there are some crates that you eventually will need to clear out, but I don't know if Roy is necessary to use that. Uh, and I don't know who else would be all that great. Bowser could get rid of that section at the bottom once you have everything cleared out. Uh, and... Mario, of course, but Koopa Troopa does nothing to help. He, at least he clears out some viruses when he can't do anything else, unlike Lakitu, who literally did nothing when there are no viruses left. But, uh, yeah, it, he he helped a little bit, I guess. I'll be nice, and I say he helped a little bit. Now, pay attention to the row of crates there, because that key on top needs to be able to get to the door underneath which means you have to get rid of that crate underneath it. And that means you have to get rid of the crate next to it at the very least because the door is blocking your access to the bottom and the key is uh, blocking your way to it on the top. So you have to clear out the side first before you can get gain access to that, uh, that final crate there that you, you have to get rid of at some point. So if you can bring an assistant who can do, uh, deal with that, uh, that would be ideal. But for me, I just uh, worked on clearing it out. Now, 
uh, I decided to just use these colored crates here, get rid of them while I'm, I'm doing this. And then I did it all in one spot here. I just kept going over and over, mostly because I was waiting for some greens, which I did finally get so I can access the other side. So I would suggest um, looking out for the colors you need. Right now I need blues and then reds. And then when you get any of the colors, you use it in the other corner because you need to get to that door as well. And if neither color works out, then you can just uh, destroy some of those crates on top and get some extra points if you want to. Like this green, I have nothing to do with, so I use it to get that blue that I had left over placed up there. And finally, I just need some more blues to uh, get to that last door there. Now most of these, I was able to get three stars um, with like zero capsules left, basically. And that's mostly due to my uh, assistants helping out with that. This one was cutting it very close, but I luckily was able to get that one on my first try. And uh, yeah, that level wasn't too bad. There was um, some puzzle aspects to it, just trying to figure out what you need to clear and uh, how to be the most efficient in doing so. But now we're moving on to the fun, or the stage that I could not do with Koopa. Uh, I actually beat it once with Koopa Troopa, but I was about 100 points away from 3 stars. And if you know this game, you know 100 points is very little. And it really frustrates me that I wasn't able to do it. I tried it at least like 10 times with Koopa Troopa and I was not able to do it. So uh, the next thing that I thought of uh, was uh, Donkey Kong. And if you know this level, you know that uh, you need single capsules to go into the middle of the top and bottom rows. So you're going to want to start saving up some smaller capsules to use there. And then the middle ones you'll have to gain access to by... Uh, clearing out the top, getting rid of those crates at the top, and then you gain access to them. But the ones on the far left and the far right are closed off uh, pretty securely by um, unbreakable blocks on one side and really heavily uh, guarded or heavily sealed crates on the other side. So what uh, Donkey Kong does specifically is you can target a, a certain spot and clear out a hole um, nine squares of uh, space, which not only clears out the, the viruses inside, but also hits some crates for some extra points and the blocks that you will eventually need to get rid of. Now, you might think that Koopa Troopa might actually be good for this one. While you, he doesn't clear as much as Wendy, he gets his skill a lot faster and does his skill, or he clears out a lot of blocks pretty quickly, but there is only a chance that he will actually attack the uh, the viruses once all the blocks are clear or all yeah all the blocks are cleared so uh, it's always a gamble whether he's actually gonna go for it now the first time I played this one he cleared both the viruses for me right away and that was when I got really close to three stars but wasn't able to do it and every single other time I played he never and I mean never hit a virus so I don't know what the deal was with that but he was not helpful and I, I don't know if Wendy would be the same or she would target viruses first, so maybe Wendy would be good. But in my experience, the blocks weren't the hard thing to clear out. It was those two remaining viruses that you have left over on the side, and that's why Donkey Kong came in handy here. Uh, and I got it right away with Donkey Kong, so I would suggest using him if you're having trouble with this. And if you have any um, other problems, maybe Roy could help out to get into the middle, but also um, Roy may not help because some of the crates you don't even need to get rid of and he might waste his time on some of the other crates So I don't know if Roy would be good. I never tested him But if you can't do it with Donkey Kong can't do it with anybody else you could do it with him and maybe Wario is good, too I, I legitimately never tried it with Wario. So maybe Wario is just fine for that one and uh, I don't I don't really know so for this one I thought I cleared this level once and then found out that the the crates and the those four crates in like the corners of the level they have to be cleared out so don't forget about that because i wasn't even thinking about it but yeah you're going to want to get to that key pretty quickly and then you um start working your way into the middle and i went for that red one up top first just because it was open like that all right i opened the key with a red one to get to the top because the the top row might be the hardest one to get to and the sides and the bottom are really easy to access so that's why I did that. Now Koopa Troopa does actually kind of help out in some ways because he gets rid of a single virus. And, and most of my experiences, he would get rid of one of the ones on the side. 
so that I could easily slide one capsule into that slot there and take out the whole um, the, the whole column there. But uh, if you don't have a Koopa Troopa, which I still wouldn't really suggest using him, um, you do have to get rid of a lot of colored crates. So um, Larry would be really good. As you might be able to see here, and my friend Patrick pointed this out too, the Koopalings are really heavily like used or suggest, or you can like, you can upbeat a lot of these levels with the Koopalings. And I don't know if that's intentional, but it sure is. Like the colored crates and the regular crates are a lot more, um, like have been a lot more used than they usually are. Uh, and I think a lot of people are noticing that as well. Uh, but yeah, once once you clear out that huge middle part, you still have to remember that the, the regular crates need to be cleared out, the colored crates all need to be taken care of, and the viruses need to be cleared as well. So literally the whole screen needs to be empty. So that's a lot of work left to do. I still have 20 capsules, so I was all right. I believe I cut it close, but I was able to do it with Koopa Troopa, like I said. Um, here when I use his skill pretty soon, um, he does help out with that last column of green viruses. So I'm able to use that, uh, that opening to get rid of those last remaining viruses. And now I can just focus on the bottom here. Um, and I would suggest going for the colored ones first because you have to use the colors that you need. And try to do what I did, like I got rid of that blue one in the middle so I could clear all those reds and, uh, with only three capsules. And then I just have these remaining greens. And if I get any reds or blues, I'm using them towards the, the crates on the sides here. Uh, and as you can see, I'm e easily going to get three stars with this. Of course, I have the point boosting assistance, but I cut it very close to not doing it. Just because, uh, I, I mean, I got lucky with the capsules that they gave me, really. I got the perfect amount of capsules I needed with the right, amount of, or with the right colors that I needed. And was able to clear that one out which made me really happy because uh, this video is going to come out a little bit later than um, the, the distance between the other two videos came out, if that makes any sense. This one will be a little bit later compared to those two, just because I had so much trouble with Koopa Troopa. But I also have some stuff going on tonight, so hopefully I'll be able to record the final levels tonight and get them out before midnight. But let's talk about this final level here. They will always give you the double green to uh, access that uh, shell, and then you start working on the 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 middle now it's just going for the bomb right away but i didn't get any reds right away either so just wait patiently clear out what you can until you get the red and then uh explode those things in the middle there now you're gonna have these two sides of lecture boxes here and even though those viruses are hidden you know that they're going to be two of the same color across like that like those reds are they're both going to be the same like that just different colors so what i suggest is taking out the um, the electric boxes first and then you can use a single capsule on each uh, row of colored viruses instead of using uh, like double the amount to do the same thing. Uh, you definitely save some capsules on that and while you're doing this if you have any other colors make sure to use them to get through this line of crates here and start working your way into the bottom section um, always making sure that you uh, clear viruses and uh, your capsules only when the electric box is ready to be cleared. Now all these go at the same one, or like they're all switching back and forth in unison. So you have to make sure that uh, you get the right um, amount of like viruses, or like the right amount of capsule, I mean. So when you're placing them, make sure that you uh, have the even amount so that that might even make any sense. You need to clear them all, or they'll all be cleared on the same rotation. So keep making sure that you're clearing them when they need to. Right here I can use all these blues to clear those all out. And now I just have these uh, few other viruses to, to get rid of here. Um, I would always make sure that uh, you kind of prioritize the electric boxes because once they're out of the way you can do whatever you want with the rest of the viruses. Uh, and I just have that one in the corner there that I take care of last. I start working on the viruses here because I have so many. I need specific colors for them. And then once I can get rid of the blue and like the green, then I can use those towards the side. And I cut this one very close, similar to how I cleared the, the previous one. Now the Koopa Troopa is not on my side with this one. 
he almost kind of ruined the round for me with that single um, that single virus taking that one out I wanted to hopefully get one of the other ones so that I could use that towards this but yeah I, I did a strategy where I could get or get rid of those reds in a single move and then luckily I had enough greens to work my way over that side and also had the perfect amount of capsules to get the rotation of the electric box on the side that I needed so there's a lot of strategy in that one if you're using someone uh, that isn't Wario <laughs> Um, there might be some problems. Roy would help you get into the middle a lot quicker. Uh, but other than that, I think Bowser would probably be pretty good just because he could get around a, get out a good amount of that. Just make sure that the electric boxes are on the right rotation so that Bowser actually clears them when he uses his skill. I think Bowser would be really good for that one, actually. That's who I would suggest, first and foremost. Maybe Mario would be pretty good, too. We're going to do two more character openings. Uh, it's nothing special. But uh, I'll take the time to say thank you guys for watching. I'll try to get the, the newer uh, levels out, the final set, as quickly as I can. So I'll see you then. Goodbye.